Remember to click subscribe and notification button for more Abbas video. Cooking Appa. Hi, this is Cooking Appa. Today I'm going to make a chicken stew. So today I have approximately uh, one chicken thigh and one uh, two wings here. Approximately probably about 400 grams of chicken. I'm using free range chicken today so you can see the beautiful yellowish skin color. Yeah. So um, then we have some uh, three things here. I'm going to add together with the chicken. I have some a little bit of uh, carrot, tomato and sweet potato. Yeah, carrot, tomato and sweet potato. I actually soak all of them inside um, water here because so that it won't get oxidized too easily. And uh, not forgetting we are going to use chicken stock. Yeah, we are going to use chicken stock to uh, make the chicken stew here. And I'm going to show you how Appa will make chicken stock in two seconds. I used to take about one to two hours, right? Many of you have followed me before, but I'm just going to use uh, my cooking appa uh, chicken powder here yeah? premium 100% chicken powder no preservative um, safe for kids definitely everything 100% natural so prepare one bowl of hot water here and put in approximately one teaspoon of chicken powder and done you have your chicken stock you can actually get this chicken stock from Shopee for both Malaysia and Singapore. I will I will leave the link, yeah, the purchase link, order link uh, inside the video description for you. We are going to put in a little bit of oil here, about two tablespoons to start with. And we are going to saute the garlic and ginger. Notice I actually keep the skin of the ginger, it's actually good for you. <laughs> yeah, ginger skin is actually good for us. Next thing, we can put in the chicken. You can marinate your chicken with a bit of uh, fish sauce or like soya sauce if you like. Why I'm not using my wok today? Just a change of uh, mood. <laughs> Sometimes you use the same thing every day, yeah, you get boring. Really fragrant. Saoxing wine. And we are going to tone down the fire now. As we are going to add in some uh, seasoning. I'm going to give it a little bit of oyster sauce here. About one tablespoon plus maybe. Two rounds of light soy sauce. Now I'm going to increase the heat. Give it a few stir. Wow, super fragrant already. Now I can add in the carrot, potato and also a sweet potato. Why is it I add in a sweet potato? Because I, uh, I opened my fridge and I saw some sweet potato inside. <laughs> clearing my fridge because tomorrow I'm traveling this is what home cook do here yeah? we uh, always clear our fridge next thing we are going to put in our two second chicken stock right so you want your ingredient to be nicely submerged under the broth if you like some darker color, feel free to add um, dark soy sauce. So I'm going to bring this to a boil and you see it's actually started to boil right now. After which, I'm going to close the lid and tune down to medium low and let it simmer under medium low heat for 30 minutes. If you like, you can actually choose to add in the salt and sugar right now rather than towards the end. I'm going to add in the salt, a bit of salt. I still can do some uh, final seasoning, yeah? I just to taste towards the end. But now, let's put in a bit of salt and also sugar. By putting in sugar, not only you're going to balance the saltiness, uh, sugar is also going to help to uh, intensify the potency of your saltiness, of your salt. So I will let it continue simmer. 